hello guys welcome back to my channel so today we're going to be doing a little gameplay um for anybody that knows me you know i am a sim enthusiast um for anybody that doesn't know me you are going to find that out today so today we're going to be doing the seven toddler challenge um which has me a little bit stressed because i feel like i'm i'm gonna, I'm gonna kill a toddler like they're gonna get taken away something's gonna happen um so there's not too many rules to it. So if you guys are familiar with the 100 baby challenge, there's a lot more rules for that one than there is for the 7 toddler challenge. So I'm just going to kind of go through and read you guys what this is and we'll get into it. Um, the way we're going to do this is you guys are going to just kind of have the game and then my face. Um, and we're just gonna go through probably into the kids age up until children or maybe shorter i might make this a two-part thing so the first part may just be creative sims and like the house if you want to see that if you don't want to see that we're just gonna go straight into the actual gameplay of it um so yeah so the seven toddler challenge it says with the toddler patch live this challenge was created in 2017 uh with the toddler patch live we need a few challenges right so Cool. we're just gonna skip down a little bit so you have to create a new family they have to have seven toddlers and only one adult to take care of all of them so which is kind of obvious because you can only have eight sims in a household unless you have any mods i don't have mods on my game so we're sticking with our eight sims uh so the challenge rules are your household has to have one adult and you can customize this um if the sim adult dies, you'll lose this challenge. If one of your toddler dies or gets taken away by child services, you have to replace it with a new toddler and start all, start all over with that one child. So you start all over with the challenge. Um, you have to create seven toddlers with a randomized two and create a sim and give them a unique trait. Toddlers can't have the same trait as their siblings. You can use a money cheat if necessary. So mother load is one that we can use. I love me some mother load. I'm probably going to use it when it comes to building our house because we're going to try to, you know, we're going to try to make it a little special. We got eight sims living in one house. Um, you can hire a nanny to help you out. If you have the Sims 4 vintage glamour stuff, you can hire a butler. I do not have glamour stuff, so we'll just hire a nanny if need be. Uh, you can buy anything you may need to take care of the toddlers, and your adult Sims can't have a job, but he or she can have hobbies. So if your Sim has time for it, but they probably won't because seven toddlers. Um, so yeah, that's it. So well, we're going to get into this now. All right, guys, so we're going to get into this now. So I'm going to start a new game up. Um, we're going to do no tutorial because we know what we're doing. We're going to get right into it. So we can either have a single mom or we can have a single dad. I'm actually going to leave it up to Siri. Um, we're going to do like a little flip of the coin and decide from there who we're going to have. So if it's heads, we'll have a mom. If it's tails, we'll have a dad. Um, and then I'm just going to do the create a story section so that way we can just kind of have a completely random mother. Um, whatever they make her look as is what we're going to have and we'll just randomize some name, maybe create a last name for her and do it that way. So hey Siri, flip a coin. Heads. Alright, so let's make her young adult, give her a little bit more time to hopefully have it together. Um, so our first question is the best food is growing yourself, caught hook, line, and sinker, or prepared by a chef? Um, let's make her a little, a bougie little plant to growing mom. So growing yourself, um, I feel most rewarded when helping people. Seems like very something with seven toddlers would say. Um, what I do to cheer myself up, spend time with family. She's going to spend a lot of time with family, so I think that's the best choice for her what do i grow in my garden so uh we're gonna do fruits and vegetables her favorite type of people are good people um it's open mic night at the bar and she's up hmm show off her music talent let's make her musically talented flowers look best when they're in a beautiful arrangement uh with defying success bettering the world and then how do I act around groups of people? I'm up, I take charge. Visiting the park to get some fresh air. So we have our 
Well, they actually made us a dad, so we're gonna fix this up, change it so that way it can go to what we needed to go for. Um, so we're just going to go up here and then we'll go back through and read that. So we're going to change gender to female. Okay, so this is what our mom is looking like. We're going to randomize her first name. I don't really like Rochelle Christina. We'll do Christina. So her name is Christina and her last name is Danielson. So Christina, da Christina Danielson. So we're going to have our Danielsons today. So her story is her career as an entertainer. She's wanted to spe she's wanted her name in lights from the time you could spell it. Answering your call as a professional entertainer, either making the audience laugh with you or melting their hearts with your melodies. So bowling a skill as guitar and violin. She has a skill in gardening. Um, she has a skill in charisma and her starting funds are standard but that's okay because we have cheats and we can change that up because we're gonna have to make a nice little house for her. Now sadly because of the rules of this challenge we're going to have to take her out of her career as an entertainer because she's one not going to have any time to work and two she can't work but we can have her make money off her guitar so if she ever decides to go on a seven toddler trip to the park she can make tips on that. Um, might also make her an artist so that way she could sell some paintings just do some things so that way we can get some some income flowing throughout this house so i'm just going let's go through and look at her outfits first so for her everyday wear you just have this one outfit right here pretty simple a little chic for her formal wear very businessy um we're gonna go back and change that we're gonna go back and change that Let's just keep going. For her active wear, okay. We can work with this. Her night wear, very comfortable. She's going to be comfortable. Her party wear, I mean, she'll probably never do that, but we can go back and change that as well. It's a little too simple for me. Might just change the jeans up or something just to give her a little bit more. Uh, her swimwear, very cute. I like it. She has a little, a little mango kini going on. This is cute. Um, for outdoor wear for the summer, we're going to have to change to uh, give her a shirt because she doesn't have one. And then for cool wear, she looks like she's just going to go skiing. We're just going to change the shoes up. So we're going to start here. Um, let's give her some boots. So we're just going to give her those boots. Pretty simple. Nothing too much. Um, for her tops, I think, I think maybe a bodysuit. Something like that would be cute. But I'm going to just give her that tank top, the little spaghetti strap. I think that's simple and cute enough for her. Uh, we'll give her some color. Give her that darkish purple fuchsia color. And then we'll just change her shoes to be... Sure, we'll give her all black flats. We're going to leave her bathing suit the same. We're going to change her party wear. So I think for this, we're just going to change her bottoms. Um, she'll probably never go out anyway, so it won't be that big of a deal. But just in case for some, you know, maybe she throws a little birthday party for the for the kids, you know, something. Give her a little bit more pizzazz to her look. Um, maybe we can give her a skirt. I'm not liking any of this. I'm truly not liking any of this. Um, sure sure we'll do it we'll do it and then do they have these in blue as well okay maybe i'll change her shirt i don't really know how i feel about her shirt right now um no because it's striped ah i just want her to look nice she's never going to get to go out anyway but she should be able to look cute for the rare chance that she does get to go out um all right we're just gonna give her some pants maybe some capris i think i have some capris in one of my little packs um this could no no that's not cute that's not cute at all um sure sure that works that works that's what she's going to wear uh it's very it's something and we'll leave her shoes as is for her pop of color her pajamas are fine her sportswear activewear is fine her formal wear you know what we're just going to change the color of her pants and maybe give her a different pair of shoes here um and leave that 
as is. She could be the type that would wear something like this. And there we go. We'll leave that there. Her everyday wear, we're going to leave it. But we'll give her, you know, we'll give her some options. Um, so she has this little calm outfit. Let's see. Maybe like a little summer dress or something. Boom. Gorgeous. So we're going to leave her with some a blue dress. Give her these shoes we're going to come up on top and we're just going to take off the headphones i think everything else works for this fit actually i've never had headphones before so i think they might actually be attached to the hat they are um oh that could be cute yeah that's a little fit right there okay give her a little something something going on she's looking cute for the culture all right cool so boom boom um you know i gotta support my black people but i also don't really want black mama with seven kids living alone but we gonna do it because i don't know we're just gonna do it mm. we'll leave her right there and then I don't know, I guess this is a Christina look. Did her hair change at all through any of these outfits, guys? I've been doing very bad at paying attention to Christina. And we haven't even really started. Christina is very basic. Her hair does not change at all throughout any of these outfits. You know what, we're going... <sighs> we're going to leave Christina as is. And we're going to move on to our first kid. So, we're going to add a new sim. And then it's going to be a toddler. that's Christine's mother okay um so our first child is a boy randomized name not Nestor we don't like Nestor Trevor okay Trevor and then last name was Danielson let me just make sure I'm spelling that right Danielson all right so let me just copy that so that way I don't have to keep writing that out so Danielson is the name we are going to randomize the trait our first trait is silly so we're going to keep in mind we can't reuse any traits um, so our first trait, silly. We're gonna go through and look at Trevor, and let's see. Trevor is very colorful, but Trevor is a child, so I think this is a good fit for Trevor. I'm gonna just give him. Oh, he's wearing rain boots under that. Okay, Trevor. Um, let's give him red rain boots instead because it matches the part of that shirt. And we're gonna go boom. Trevor's already doing better than his mother look at his little formal attire pajamas fine party wear sure Trevor sure um bathing suit cool outdoor wear for the heat I like to make them look a little cute so we're just gonna give him a little color in there so we'll go black and brown and then for his outside wear, I think this baby's going to freeze. But look at him and his little clock goggles. Look at him. We're going to change this though. We're going to give him up. We'll give him a vest. And we'll do, because he's wearing these blue pants, we'll do this one. And then we'll change the shoes. Give him the little black little boots. Alright, so our first child is done. We're going to make our next toddler. Let's play with genetics here okay so let's make a girl we're just gonna go back and forth um randomize twin yes we're gonna fix her i don't like her hair i don't like it um yeah i don't like it we're gonna Let's cover these little curls. These are cute. Oh wait, let's just let's go through and look a little bit more. All right, now we're gonna give our first girl the little bun buns. All right, so we're gonna go through. Let's go through her outfits. Actually, let's give her a name. Let's give her a name. Lorena, no. Jane, no. Michelle, Michelle Danielson. Okay, and her randomized trait is she's angelic. All right, so her first outfit, this is cute. You got a little, you know, the little bubbles going on with the star necklace. 
We got the pants, the little snow boots. Michelle has a little fit. So we're going to go to formal. Boom. Perfect already. All right. Um, let's just give her a matching pajama shirt just in case I got to start mixing colors up. I know who's who. Um, and then for party with Michelle has Michelle's got a down pack, guys. OK, she is ready. I don't have to do anything for her. Look at her bathing suit. Michelle is stunning. All right. So even her summer wear, her outdoor wear for the summer is cute. Boom. Michelle is ready. Michelle is ready. Do we have any other colors though? Um, sure, we'll keep her with the orange. All right, so we have Michelle. So we're going to add another sim. Play with genetics again. We're going to add a sibling for Michelle. We're going to randomize a brother. Randomize twin and go. So now we have, let's see what his name is going to be. We have Ethan Danielson. His randomized trait is he's a charmer. Okay, so we're going to go through Ethan's outfits. I think his little haircut's cute. All right, so we have Ethan in this. Um, I do like this orange look that we're going for. So I think. I think I'm going to just change that shirt and I'm going to leave it as is and then give him these little shoes. His formal attire, sure. Can I change his pants? No, we're going to leave his pants as is. Maybe just change the, we're going to change it to a brown. We're going to change it to a brown and then we're going to leave his shoes as they are for his pajamas. Boom, we got the little cowboy fit on. We're just going to change the color to orange so that way it matches the shirt because we're going to have to reuse pajamas. Um, party wear. He's stunning. He's here. He's ready. His swimwear, boom, it's on. His outdoor heat wear is matching and his cold wear, Ethan is ready to change the game. So we're going to add another sim. Let's make this one look a little bit more like um, the mom. So we're going to create his... Actually, I lied. Yeah, no, we're going to make it look more like the mom. All right, so we're going to click on Christina. Then we're going to click on the genetics part. And we're going to create her child. We're going to make another toddler. Randomize a daughter. Alright, so we got a little chocolate baby in the group. The rest of them are a little light bright. So, we got a little chocolate baby. That's actually great because I think I want to give her... We want to give her these... Yes, we're giving her the locks. The little lock pigtails. Absolutely, freaking lootly okay? Let's go back. We're going to name her Catalea. Sure, Catalea Danielson, okay? She is up here and she is ready and she is not playing with none of you. All right, so we're going to keep Catalea in her little green fit. We're going to change her formal wear to give her some actual bottoms because she don't got no right now. Um, actually, let's do one of these full made things. I think Catalea is a little clean, so I'm gonna give her. I'm gonna give her this, and then I'm gonna change her shoes to those blue ones right there. We're going to look at her sleepwear. Catalea wears little glasses, guys. Look at her little glasses. Catalea is staying like this because none of the other siblings look like her. Because Catalea is a boss. All right. Mm, her full body party wear. Let's give her, I think one of the other sisters is wearing something like this, but we're going to give her, we're giving her the yellow one and that matches perfectly. Her bathing suit, we got a yellow one of these too. I like this one. And then her hot wear, cool. Um, she might be so a little hot in that, so we're going to give her a skirt and then change her shoes. Let's give her those. And then her, her cold wear. Look at that little jacket. Look at this little jacket this little queen has on. We're going to give her the pink one. I think that matches fine. So we have four kids already. Uh, let's make another child that looks like Catalea. Let's make it her twin brother. So we're going to play with genetics and we're going to make Catalea her twin brother. 
are bright. Look at him. He has the little dreads too. This is beautiful. I love it. So, his name, Brendan. Brendan Danielson. Oh, wait. We didn't give Catalea a trait. We got to go back, guys. All right. Catalea's random trait is she is inquisitive. All right. So, now we're going to give Brendan his trait. And Brendan is also inquisitive. We can't do that. So, we're going to randomize again. Ooh, Brendan's fussy. This is going to be a problem, child. All right. So, let's give him some clothes because Brendan is... Brendan's half naked right now. Let's give him a little hoodie. I think this is cute. Um, let's give him this yellow one with the fox. It's like a yellowy orange. Ooh, and these little cargos. Okay, and then we're going to give Brendan some red sneakers. Boom, Brendan has a fit. Look at his formal wear. He is in a whole little tux. He is out here shaping the game. His pajamas, boom. We're gonna change the shirt though because we have somebody in that shirt. So we're gonna change the color to match his pants. Okay, his party attire. I don't like the hat. I don't like the hat. So um, is there a base? But nope, there's no other hat. That's a hat. Nope, we're gonna take the hat away. Um, okay, boom. His swimwear, we got him in the black. Can we get a burst of color? Boom, put him in the yellow. All right, his hot wear, we're just going to give him some green shorts because he got a little colorful fit. And then his outdoor wear, we're going to change his coat. Give him this one. And then we're going to change his shoes. We're going to give him some black and white ones. Boom, Brendan is ready. So we have five kids. Um... All right, we're just gonna make a random sim now that looks like nobody um toddler mm. okay mother brother 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 sister brother i don't really like this one so we're gonna do it again and all these kids are like super I want some color variation come on give me all right i guess we'll do it ourselves all right so last name is daniel singh first name is stacy she looks like a stacy all right we're gonna randomize her trait we have charmer i think we had that already though we did so we got to change stacy's trait energetic we have not had that one yet all right, so we're gonna go and we're gonna give Stacy some clothes. I like her little first fit. We're gonna keep her as she is for that. And look at her little messy bun. All right, Stacy. Stacy's a little cutie. All right, so then we're gonna give her her formal wear. I think that's cute. We're just going to change her shoes, make them make them white. No, we're gonna make them a little gray color. I think that's cute too. All right, Stacy's trying to be like what was her name, Catalea? She's trying to be like Catalea, but it's cool. She got her little onesie on. All right. Her party wear. I'm going to need to change that. Um, we're just, nobody's worn this yet. You're going to give her purple overalls with her little shoes. Her swimwear. We'll give it that one right there because it's the same thing. Um, Sure. And then her. Sure. That all works. So this is Stacy. All right, so one, two, three, four, five, six. But I wanted to change Stacey's skin tone. I forgot about that part. I almost, I almost sent her out here looking like that. Wouldn't have been a problem, but I want to see some more variation. Let's make her darker than mom. Babe, we, we can make her red if we really wanted to, but I'm not going to do that. I'm going to make her... Hmm. Wait, where did I go? No. You gonna make Stacy that color? I like that shade of brown on her. But now I think I need to make her clothes pop a little bit more. So that one works. That one still works. That still works. Mm, I'm a little iffy with this one. Um, we're gonna give her. We're gonna change it to this because I feel like that pops on her skin a little better. And then we're gonna give her yellow shoes. We're gonna change her her bathing suit to be a brighter color so we're gonna come over here um that's beautiful that's beautiful 
and then we're gonna change her coat as well but that was that was really not caring about Stacy to begin with if I was being completely honest with you guys um so we're gonna give her a little bit more care um yeah that works and then this Stacy was really out here looking like somebody's grandma just threw some clothes on her. I'm so sorry, Stacy. Let me treat you right now. Um, we'll keep that. You know, we'll give you some capris. We'll give her some of the capris. She still looks like somebody's grandma just threw their clothes on her. But we're going to figure it out together because we can't have Stacy out here looking like this. Maybe we can give her a white shirt. Yeah. Yeah, we'll give her a white shirt. And then we'll change her shoes to a white and black color. Got her little sandals on. Um, you know, we're going to give Stacy a skirt because the more I look at this, the more I feel bad. Give her a yellow skirt. There we go. All right. And then we're going to make a twin for Stacy. This should be our last toddler. Guys, I'm going to be, I'm so stressed already. Um, so our last toddler, we're going to play with genetics. We're going to give Stacy a twin brother. And a must twin um i don't really like the silky hair can i get a different one sure we don't have anybody with a shortcut like that yet all right so our last danielson his name is fletcher fletcher danielson here we go all right and then his randomized trait is fussy i think we had fussy um we have energetic we have fussy. We do have fussy. All right. Inquisitive. We had that. Energetic. We had that. Silly. Did we have silly? We have silly. Okay. Come on, Fletcher. Angelic. Are there enough for it? one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. All right, so which one are we missing? Clingy. We didn't do clingy and we didn't do independent. I mean, to make this a little easier on myself, I'm gonna make him independent. We don't got an independent kid yet. So I wanna see Mr. Fletcher be incredibly independent and show his mama that she don't, he don't need her. He gonna go and teach himself on the blocks. So Fletcher is independent. We gotta get colors that pop on Fletcher's skin as well. Um, so let's look. I like this little orange shirt that he has with his pants. So we're gonna leave that as it is. His formal wear. <laughs> we're gonna just give him some pants. Um, some white ones. Yeah, let's give him white pants. Fletcher look. She looked like she would have Fletcher dressing like this. So we're gonna change this, and then we're just gonna go up here. We're going to keep Fletcher with some glasses, but we're going to give him the cool kid glasses, okay? Look at him. He's looking adorable. He's going to snatch everybody up off these streets. Every little grandma going to come over grabbing his cheeks. Um, we're not going to do any glasses for bed. We're going to change it to the blue one because I do like that shade of blue. Fletcher's going to have his blue pajamas on for his party. Where Look at Fletcher. Look at him. I'm going to change his pants, though. Maybe just the color. nothing matches perfectly we're gonna give him black no i don't like the black on his skin all right we're gonna get fletcher that it doesn't match as well as i wanted to but it's cool and then these shoes these are the shoes that fletcher needs to wear with his little party outfit all right and then his swimwear his yellow trunks sure all right his hot outside wear he has a little white shirt on we're just gonna give him pink shorts with it even though his buttons are blue or should we give him yellow i like the mm. Oh no, they have the blue to match it. There's a blue to match it. We're gonna give him these little shoes with the clouds because we haven't used these yet. And then his little his little cold fit. Um, we haven't used this on anybody yet, so we're gonna. Um, I'm gonna give him his little white and red Santa looking thing, and then we're gonna change his shoes to the black and red ones. And Fletcher is ready to go. So let's just make sure we have all of our relationships good with everybody. This is our Danielson household. Look at them. Look at all them little chillums. We're going to press our check button. I should have uploaded them. Damn it. Whatever. They're saved. My, yeah, we'll fix it later.